what's up y'all, this is Shampoo from Shibuya, back here with another video. So me and the missus, we went to Tokyo Ikebukuro, we went to Nanja Town, which is kind of a theme park in Japan, and they have promotions to have one with Godzilla. And on the way there, uh, we stopped at a burger joint in Japan called Luteria, and as you can see, they got a little promotion going on for Shin Gojira. I got a free magnet when I got, you know, the kind of burger set here. They had some other, like, useless kind of giveaways too, but I got the magnet, that was the most, you know, useful one, I thought. Um, so then in Ikebukuro, so I just want to make a quick video showing kind of the event and stuff like that. So that for a limited time, they have this Godzilla foot that's coming down through the uh, with the mall that they have there in Sunshine City. And they have, uh, at certain times, they have a photo session, so you can actually take a photo with the foot. Uh, usually it's kind of like tapered off like this. Um, so this is me, you know, standing outside of it. Um, and then later, me and the Mrs. Shampoo took a photo under the foot. So I was getting smashed by it. She's going to lift up trying to lift up the toe off me and stuff, pretty cool. Um, so this is Nanja Town, um, this is the entrance to it, and when you go in, um, collectors, you know what this is, I mean, you have X-Plus, Bandai, Godzilla figures lined up, a lot of rare stuff is lined up when you first walk in, and it's all, you know, in front of these awesome uh, line of, you know, the Showa era posters and things like that. So a lot of rare figures, a lot of cool stuff, and... You'll see here in a second they have um, the Evangelion, kind of like crossover Kiryu uh, figures that they... I'm not sure if they're out yet. If not, they will be soon. Uh, we got Godzilla over there with his eyes that light up. You'll see that in a second. Some more uh, posters around here. And like I said, uh, Godzilla we just saw, his eyes light up and he kind of roars. And his spines light up too. It's kind of hard to see in the video though. Um, so once you go inside, they have a little gift shop area where they have a t-shirt for the uh, event. Um, they have some other stuff too that you can see here. They have Godzilla cookies. They have um, cell phone cases. And then they have these kind of like magnet uh, clips, which are what these are here. And, you know, I wasn't really too impressed with the stuff they had for sale. I didn't really buy anything. And then you got these little keychains that have a crossover with the uh, mascot for the kind of theme park. Um... Where it's like a little cat, so a little cat in Godzilla suit. It's kind of cute, but I don't really need it. I had a little display set up for the, you know, SH Monster Arts figures, which are cool. And the Daruma uh, figure line that they kind of started recently as well, too. And then the coolest thing there is they had uh, Godzilla desserts. So they had one for Godzilla, but I just thought the Mothra ones looked so much cooler. Um, so me and Mr. Shampoo each got one. I got the Mothra uh, crepe, which is what you'll see here. And as you can see, I'm kind of trying to take the video before it melts away on me. Uh, but it looks pretty sweet. Uh, they got Mothra kind of set up, um, like a cocoon on Tokyo Tower. And then you got little uh, the fairy twins on the cookie there as well, too. And then Mrs. Shampoo, she got the Mothra larvae uh, pie, which was really good. They were both really good, but this pie was really good. And as you can see, it just looks awesome, too. Like, it's awesome that they made, you know, these kind of desserts around the uh, kaiju creatures. So that's going to do it for the video. I just want to make a quick short video showing you what's going on with uh, Godzilla events in Tokyo and stuff like that with the new movie that's out now. A lot of events promoting it. Um, I'll definitely be coming back with some more videos next week. So make sure to check back and we'll see you next time. Peace.